There were four people in the room the night DEA agent Ricky Sandoval was murdered. El Sueño, the head of the Santa Blanca cartel, Ricky, and the last two were La Yuri and El Polito. Yuri and Polito met at a poor state-run hospital in Chiapas, where El Polito was doing his residency, and La Yuri worked as a nurse. It was love at first sight. From the first moment their eyes met, they were inseparable. A love like no other. One day, a Buchan named La Plaga walked into the ER, all shot up. It was touch and go for a while, but Yuri and Polito were able to save his life. La Plaga was grateful. He showered them with gifts, invitations to the most exclusive parties, even a new car. And after a while, La Plaga made Yuri and Polito the personal medical staff of the Santa Blanca cartel. But that wasn't their main job. See, Yuri and Polito know about the human body. They know how much pain a person can endure before he'll die. They know how to keep a person alive and awake so they can feel the pain. And most of all, they know how to inflict that pain. That's what they do in Itaqua province. When Santa Blanca captures someone that refuses to talk, the Yuri and El Polito make them talk. They break people. Like I said, there were four people in the room the night Ricky Sandoval was murdered. Sueño, Ricky, Yuri, and Polito. They kept Ricky alive while Sueño tortured him. Non-stop for 47 hours straight. They broke Ricky Sandoval. Then Sueño executed him. The hunt starts now. We want Sueño...